My father lost a brother, the brother's wife, his own mother, his sister and his sister's husband. When the camps were open and, and it was realized that six million Jews had been killed, of which one or two million children, people were so flabbergasted. I cannot imagine a German official helping a German Jew get false identification papers. The Italians saved 40,000 Jews, which is not a known fact. I think that the Italians as a whole, who helped us Jews, knew exactly what they were doing. And this is why I refuse to say that I was in a concentration camp. I was interned, not in a concentration camp by single people, by institution, by clerics. Many, many priests and cardinals helped the Jews. They did not deport Italians who helped Jews. They shot them. They executed the secretary of the bishop. That man wasn't the only one who take a chance. A lot of Italians took a chance. These people opened up their home, they opened up their, uh, their lives, and they put their lives at risk. Between the fascists and the Germans, they knew very well that helping a Jew, they would be put against the wall and shot. For the Italian people, we were human beings, equal to them. All these Italians, they knew there was no, there was no difference between a Jew and a non-Jew for them. The Italians were people to save you, to help you, and they figured you are just as much a human being as I am. I wouldn't be here today if I didn't live in Italy. I'm alive today at 86 because of Italy and the people. <laughs>